We've been doing business with Snowco for 25 years. My father has stores, and so we're very close with the broker. And he called us up. He said, I got a nice location for you. He really thinks the area's coming back. We're going to try to keep it clean for the community. No loitering allowed. We went in there knowing the stigma. Yeah, we talked about it you know, before we purchased anything. We had a location similar to this in Buffalo, and we cleaned it up. And with time and hard work, we could change it. I really believe we can. We're going to have extra employee per shift. It's not going to be one person per shift, so maybe might be two or three. We're not going to allow no hanging around. We're going to try to work with law enforcement, the local law enforcement, and stuff. Try to keep it very clean. No shady business. No shady characters hanging around. We redid the concrete that was from the door of the store all the way around the canopy. It was broken up. And now we're going to do blacktop from the corner of Windsor all the way up to the Sunoco sign. And we're going to leave the area where there's plantation going on and stuff. We're going to leave that and probably put some more plants over there. It's going to look nice. It's been a long process. It's six months. We've been traveling back and forth from Buffalo every day and coordinating with people, getting things done. I'm hoping maybe two to three weeks will be open. We changed everything from the roof to the floor to the counters, the shelves. So we've been working working real hard. We're going to have a gas sale when we open. We're going to try to be cheaper per gallon for the first 